What is going on guys? Welcome to a brand new video. Welcome back to the channel. It's Dev. We're here. Always Sunny. Season 6, Episode 3. Last on, Dennis got divorced. Uh, yeah, I got divorced. The lawyer got involved. Charlie's uncle got involved. Dennis has to pay off. Was it like dead or something like that? It's pretty fucking hilarious. And, uh... Now, yeah, yeah, I'm excited to see what happens next here in Season 6, Episode 3. In 3, 2, 1... So, do you like to buy a boat? I guess we have recently come into a Fuck considerable yeah. amount of money. Now, we're not going to bore you with the details, but let's just say my friends here set off on a certain towel venture, dicktowel.com. Oh! That's true, but yeah, technically we're doing a couple things on the hush hush from Uncle Sam. The point is we're flush. We are $2,500 flush. So don't worry about that. We'd like to take some of that money and take a little bit of the high life. Absolutely. We've also talked our friend here into throwing his entire life savings into the venture. Mm -hmm. That's right. You see, I'm in it for the lifestyle as well as the great investment. Okay, well, then, uh, what is it you guys are looking for? Let's talk um, needs, please. I'd like to talk needs first. No, I have the need for speed. <laughs> I have the need for speed. We can do about it, so speed is a must. Absolutely, but we are also looking to entertain guests upon this boat, so... Yeah, we're gonna throw some P. Diddy-style parties up on the deck. Some P. Diddy parties. Uh, for a minute, uh, I'd like the boat to be able to haul in a tremendous amount of shrimp. Uh, sort of a Forrest Gump-size amount of shrimp. Um, you should be writing this deck. God damn it. Oh, uh, let me just see if I have this right here. Please, correct me if I'm wrong. It, it seems, seems like, like what you guys are looking for is some sort of uh, P. Diddy style shrimping vessel. Ah, oh, right! That's <laughs> You're a really good listener. I didn't thank you for one when I walked in here because of the thank you ring, but that's great! You know, I've got just the boat for you. <laughs> well, here she is, a drowning sailor. But uh, doesn't meet a lot of any of your specs. Look, I'm gonna level with you, pal. We, we saw this coming a mile away. And We've had our hearts set on this boat thing for days now, which... For days. ...is a level of focus in which I personally have never experienced. But I'm going to go on a limb here, and I'm going to say... Oh, that, that, mm, what are you doing? I was... I was, I was oh, yeah, it's been waiting way too long. We wanted to buy a boat. Let's well, get it was the taking a little while because I was doing a little presentation. Yes, yeah, what if someone it. walks down the deck and makes an offer before us? Who's going to make an offer before I finish my thing? They I'm might sorry. have. We're not the only people in town that are here. I'm confused. Are you going to take the boat or not? Yes, we're, we're taking the boat. We're buying the boat. We're going to add a little fanfare to the situation. My friend's here. They could wait. For that, yes, we're, 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 we're taking the boat. So dramatic. The gang buys a boat. That's, that's fantastic. What? Yeah, absolutely. Well, the houseboat offers all the advantages of a house, but with the excitement of the sea. Think of all the fish we're gonna catch. Uh, you guys gonna think about shrimp, okay? Oh. We're gonna be hauling in so much shrimp every day, it's gonna pay for itself ten times over. Picture tiny shrimp crawling all over this boat. Every okay, inch. But guys, can, can we not focus on the shrimp? Because we have so much work to do. It's a shrimp boat. I like having. This isn't diddy ask at all. No, no, we gotta get rid of all this shit. Guys, crazy. This boat is awesome. How about a little of this? He did a boat dance. Uh -huh. You look like one of those inflatable dancing things at the youth. Yep, yep. Oh, I don't have a good. Inflatable arm flailing tube man, whatever it was in Family Guy. You know, I'm looking forward to is catch me some Delaware River catfish. Oh, yeah. They are so tasty. I used to eat them when I was a kid. You can't buy them in stores no more. Why not? The goddamn EPA. They says they're toxic. Toxic, my ass. I mean, they're just, just endangered. Uh, Frank, this boat is the best investment I ever made, man. I mean, it's huge. Uh, we're going to pop over to the boat store real quick and grab some, uh, whoa. What the hell are you guys doing? Loading our gear. No, 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 no. You should not be loading. No one should be bringing anything onto the boat. You should be scraping. Yeah, that's so straight. Oh, well, we're going to scrape the boat. We are going to scrape the boat. Are you patronizing me? Don't, Don't patronize me. Don't do that. No one's patronizing you, all right? Look, here's what we'll do. We'll scrape all these little delicious oysters or whatever off the side of the boat. We'll put delicious the oysters. We'll cook them for you. There you go. Those are barnacles. Do not eat those. Do not cook them in a pot and serve them to us. Okay. Well, Don't do all that. Honestly? Don't, Don't eat those. those. You'll, You'll get, get very, very, very sick. Yeah. Okay? Now, now that is a direct order from your captain. Wow. <laughs> Since when are you the captain? Well, clearly I'm the captain. Uh, Who else will be the captain? I think I would be the captain. Dennis? 
I don't give a shit. I'm Captain. I call it locked in. Boom. Scrape. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I ain't scraping shit. No, 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 no scraping. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna fire up the boat, right? Yeah. We're gonna take it out into the ocean. We're gonna get some oysters and shrimpies. <laughs> Bust it again. Here you go. Oh my god. Just the keys. I throw them right out. I asked you to toss them. You threw them overhand. That's the way I throw. So jump in there and get them. I'm not going in there. I don't sink. What? I get in there. I just. Like a Don't give me lines, man! Jump in the ocean and get the damn You go on in! Son of a bitch! <laughs> okay, buddy. Uh, I got some turpentine, some wax, and some high gloss bow things. Shit, it is really expensive. Oh, dude, yeah, you're telling me. I picked us up some new slacks and dock siders so we could have the right look, you know, and fit in and everything. I have the right look. We're only real one remaining dick towel money, though. Plus, we gotta fill that thing up with gas. Oh, man, we gotta pop by the department store and pick up the mattress. I'm gonna get a nice one, too. Yeah, the, 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 the what? The mattress? What do we need a mattress for? What do you mean, what do we need a mattress for? Why in the hell do you think we just spent all that money on a boat? The whole purpose of buying the boat in the first place was to get the ladies nice and tipsy topside so we can take them to a nice, comfortable place below deck. God damn it. They can't refuse. Oh, uh, okay. You had me go in there for the first part. The second half kind of threw me. Well, dude, dude, think about it. She's out in the middle of nowhere with some dude she barely knows. You know, she looks around what she sees. Nothing but open ocean. Ah, uh, there's nowhere for me to run. What am I going to do, say no? Okay, that, <laughs> that seems really dark now. <laughs> Dude, Mac, he's like, uh, huh? Uh, huh? <laughs> she would never say no because of the implication. Oh, the, the look on his face. You said that word implication a couple of times. What, what implication? The implication that things might go wrong for her if she refuses to sleep with me. No, not that things are going to go wrong for her, but she's thinking that they will. Sounds like she doesn't want to have Why sex with me. Why aren't you understanding this? I don't, she, she, she doesn't, doesn't know whether she wants to have sex with me. It's that she that's doesn't not know. the issue. Are you gonna hurt be, I'm not going to hurt oh, these women. Okay. Why would I ever hurt these women? I, I feel like you're not getting this at all. Oh, my God. Well, don't you look at me like that. You certainly wouldn't be in any danger. Oh. No one's in any danger. No one's in any danger. of danger. Let's drop it. Let's drop it. Let's drop it. Let's find your shit and let's get out Oh, my God. That's so funny. There's so much cool shit down there. I'm gonna keep diving and looking for it. I need a flashlight because it's dark. Flashlight coming up. Toss it to me real quick. Come on, man. I throw over here. Jesus bro. fucking Christ. Drop. Oh. Uh, <laughs> well, this is a shithole, isn't it? Yeah. Maybe she could Just throwing all sorts of shit in the fucking ocean. That's incredible. Ah, here we go. Let's start with this beautiful lady here. Whoa! Crash and burn. Think about like all the all the movies and, and the books and all the stories of all the terrible, awful, awful things that have happened out in the middle of the ocean. You know, that's the stuff that's like rattling around in her head. You know, and oh my God, he's still going on about it. That's all I'm saying. It's not like a big thing. Uh huh. Look, I need you to understand this, okay? You're making it seem like I'm some sort of monster. Yeah. Okay. Hey. <laughs> you should have seen this. What do you think you guys are talking for 45 minutes and you destroy the interior of the boat, you lose the keys. I can get those keys. I just need you guys to buy me some scuba equipment so I can stay down. Do you realize how much money scuba equipment costs? No, rent the cheap stuff. Just rent some cheap stuff, right? The cheap In the stuff. In the meantime, we'll clear all the He's just going to crab him one of them. And by the time you guys come back, I promise you, I promise... The boat will be looking better. I can't tell. Is he patronizing me again? <laughs> it's, what he's saying is really stupid, but it's sincere. Okay. But it's sincere. <laughs> sorry, Charlie. I'm sorry, too. That was patronizing! Stop. You can't patronize your captain! That's a sea law! That's a sea law. We can't be spending money on CDs that I already own. We're spending too much money as it is. It's bad enough I let you buy that stupid inflatable guy from the car lot. Oh, I can't do it. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! God damn it! 
Why the inflatable arm failing too, man? This aggressive music you're playing. This is not boat music. It's got nothing to do with the music. What is boat music? <laughs> What's boat music? Get to work, we'll do the trim, and then we'll be done. Us? Oh, no, 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 no. we're not going to be doing any of that. No, no, no. We're not going to be doing any of that. What do you mean? We're not going to be doing any of the work. That's, that's what you guys are doing, huh? That was the whole deal. No, we got a party to get ready for. So. Wait, we're going to do all the work. Billionaires versus the working class. <laughs> Uh, no, no, Bourgeoisie of the proletariat. Something's gonna cheer you up. What? Guess who found the key? Yeah. Oh, he's floating under the boat. He got a little floaty thing. Oh, this is amazing, by the way. These floaty things. We should patent this. Oh, <laughs> we should patent this. What? Okay, I think this is it. This is much more our speed. Oh my God, they're the way they're dressed. It's a boat. <laughs> ahoy, ahoy. Hi, hi, a uh, couple of fellow yachters saw your flyer at the boat store. Oh. Did, did we have the wrong yacht? No, 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 no. Come on in, grab a drink. We just get warmed up. Uh, okay, sure. Let's just. Good. Yeah. God, they're so out of place. Hey, bro. How'd you lose that hand? Diabetes. Oh. Tragic. We're gonna have a couple of tasty treats out there. It's gonna get nuts out there, fellas. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna be out on open ocean, right? Hey, right? anything can happen out there. No laws, right, boy? Just us and our tasty treats. Oh shit! <laughs> I love it. I feel like you're lumping me in with that. Gentlemen, the moment you've all been waiting for. <laughs> wow. Let's get back to shrimp. They're gonna toss this shit. It's crap anyway. Oh. Ooh, that's not good. Uh, hey. Um, what do you do if the boat is on fire? What do you mean? Boat is on fire. Oh, fire's getting bit. Boat is on fire. Fire's getting bit. Help. Holy shit. Uh, find some water. Find some water. Find some water. What do you mean, find some water? <laughs> So much more romantic in the middle of nowhere, where we can be completely alone, and you can make rash decisions based on fear. <laughs> right, Dennis? Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! I thought we told you guys to beat it! No more ditty balls! You didn't catch this sniffing at my heels! All the way endangered my ass! It's a billion of them! What the hell happened? <laughs> Oh, the swim! Charles, where's the boat? What happened to the boat? <laughs> the inflatable tube man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, that was a good episode. I like the episodes where they're out doing something, and this one being out at, out at sea, getting a boat, always fucking shit up. Frank throwing the keys just in the water was crazy. Dennis, you know, being the psychopath he is, <laughs> just talking about what you'd do. And the ramification, like, it's it's crazy. Everything with Dennis is just, it's... Insane. The implication. The, the implication of it all. I love the delivery from Mac where he's just like, dude, that's that's really dark, man. <laughs> like, it's like, holy fuck. Um, and just, it was a wacky episode. It truly was a wacky episode. I wonder how much money Charlie has in his savings account. Probably like... God, 25 bucks. That was his investment. 25 bucks. <sighs> hey, Dictile.com did good, though. They said they made what? $2,500 or something like that. So, hey, there you go. Or was it 25? I don't remember. Something like that. 35, 25, whatever. But, uh, great stuff. Ladies and gentlemen, we got some 
pretty decent sized nuggery here. Oh my god. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we got some pretty decently, pretty good sized nugs of the, the gas. Of the Gassington City. The Blue Dream, ladies and gentlemen. The Blue Dream. Good stuff. It's good stuff. Future thumbnail. <laughs> Great episode, though. Great episode. Don't got much else to say. I'm just enjoying the show, man. I'm enjoying the show. I'm riding through the episodes. Got a long, long and a lot of episodes. So I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. If you did, please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell for daily videos every single day. Follow me on Twitter, Twitch, TikTok, and Instagram. And all the social media is down in the description below. And we'll catch you for another video. Goodbye!